in this video, I'm gonna do a quick walk around and just show most of what's here to where people can see because I have so many people asking about cars and I needed to do an update video. So smash that like. I've been doing a lot of mining videos and such. Check them out because the investment I've made into that has been one of the greatest investments I've ever made, ever in my life. Crypto, life-changing, serious. Check out my other videos. And in fact, I get people complain about not having enough car videos. Go look at how many views my car videos get. They don't get many. Since I was shadow banned and that whole thing happened, the car videos, you guys don't get in your feed or you, I don't know. These other videos, there's a community there that I'm talking to people and I'm getting a lot of subscribers just from those videos. So check those out. I'm telling you, there's something there. And if you've waited on crypto, you haven't waited too long, but you kind of have. And I kind of did, but I'm on board now. So that's that, here we go. All these beautiful classics out here. They're just everywhere, I tell you. And it's an absolutely gorgeous day. Here we go. One on a car guy, one on a car guy.com. I've been doing a lot of mining videos and stuff like that lately. And I've had people ask me to do a walk around of the lot. And I'm not really, not really ready to do a walk around and show in full and in detail. I want to get more weeds out of the way and stuff before the snow falls. But at the same time, I've got so many people calling on cars that I need to make a video of at least what I've got here. So that's what this is about. It's just mostly about what I've got here. I'm gonna step off this here platform, which is the trailer. So I got Chevy trucks, we'll just go up here. There's a full video of this on my site. It's got a 396 in it, 700 R4. It's bad to the bone. It's been converted from a K10, uh, K15 type thing. It's, yeah, from a K10 to a K20. It's got three quarter ton, eight lug wheels and everything. This is bad to the bone. That's all there is to say about it. Got Mercedes and I got one of these amphibious little things up here. And that's the kind of stuff that I'll probably end up selling local because scrambling. Because it's just not worth trucking across the country. But maybe I'll find somebody close that, you know, is interested. So that thing I'll get rid of so cheap. It's a thorn in my side. Great car, but I just kind of got screwed on the roof and Long story short, it's a long story. Cuck V, I'm waiting for an injector pump. I think we got that handled. I got stuff back here that I haven't even showed that we moved last year. Nice 59, it's that weird one. It's like a cross between a 180 and a 220. I think they call it a, maybe a 219 maybe, I believe. Um, nice little diesel, it's a clean car. And that one's gonna be mostly a parts car probably. The garden is gone and it is fall, I guess you'd say. Euro model 380 SEL? SE or SEL? I don't know. But clean car. It's only got 83,000 original miles of this. Clean, yeah, 81. Hope you can see that. Beautiful day in the valley. And beside the cup key, got this little Cadillac that are getting retarped here. This thing is a runner driver. Nice car. An actual clean interior. These are getting to be white sought after. Look at this. That's a clean car. Wow, oh, listen to that door. Transams up the yin yang. I got a guy calling me on some of these. I got about 25 of them. Uh, this limo, it's a clean limo. With just the top, needs some help. But everything else, it's a clean car. Actually filled it up with stuff and drove it up from San Diego. Drove just fine. Got 20 something miles a gallon on the limo. Now this limo, if you're looking for a cool project, this is exactly what this is. It's a cool project. Uh, 71, I believe. Fleetwood factory limo. You can flip up the third row. Oh, my tire's in there. See? That's why I'm not ready to do a walk around. But video on the channel of this, 51,000 original miles. Sweet truck. Video on the channel of this, and this is new paint. Very clean car. Full video on my channel. This is no video of, I bought it, it's got a head gasket problem. It's got the wheels and wheels and stuff. I love these um, W140s and I've never been without one since I drove one. And I'm glad I got a coupe right now because I won't ever be without one of these cars. I love them. This is coming out for sale. It's cheap. And it's got low miles. It's got funky, ugly, crappy, kitty wheels. It's got some 79,000 miles. It needs a little bit of this and a little bit of that. It does. But it's still correct. Some tires on crap. But total project, full, total cool project. This thing I just put the video up on. Government owned, one owner. I'm telling you, 
every bit of metal on this thing as clean as can be. The doors open and close. Look at this. The wear from like riding around. Man, look at that seat. I just did a video of this. Um, the Z71, I actually, Katrina has been loving driving this thing. It's the limited or whatever it's called. Um, very rare vehicle. It comes with a lot of extras on it, like the brush guard and the solid color grill and bumper and skid pads underneath it and Nerf bars. All this factory, man. Factory Alcoa at wheels, I believe. Um, yeah, this just needs to go. It's kind of it's got that injector problem. This is a nice little sport wagon. Um, it's not really leaking or nothing. It's not all musty in there yet. It's um, clean. It's not all rusty. And I will sell it. I'm, I'm going to do... It just takes a while to get to do pictures and walk arounds and stuff. I, I can't go over each individual car. But once this stuff's out, I mean... It seems like it never happens though. You know? It just... There's a lot of stuff to do. Look at them Trans Amps. That's just... That's just a thing of pure beauty right there. It is. Wow, there's a slow zoom on this camera. We're going to speed that up. I'll bet you speed it up and it gets blurry. Just did the video of this. Just did the video of that. Two good clean pickups. Um, these are really rare. And for sale, man. It's just for sale. This will be coming up. It's almost done. Got a starter in it. This thing runs, it drives. And um, we'll be getting the title work here done this week. This thing is ready to go and show. Well, maybe not show, but it's ready to go. Put this down. Since it looks like it might sprinkle. There we go. Got the Thames then. This thing is tiny. And look at this. I can't believe they, they did. They sprayed over it. That sucks. It really does. It's so long ago that the phone number is three numbers. Isn't that cool? I mean, that's like, it's like the 30s or 40s, man. Cool rig for sure. You make a nice project. And I got part of a 65 Impala in there. And part more coming. But... It is definitely a cool, cute little van. Um, I got this short bed, step side, little Red Express project over here. It's a good little truck. It's solid. It's not rusty. It's been rebuilt. Kids shot the windows out. BB gun. So that's what that is. I'm not going to go over there very much because it's just a lot of stuff. There's too much stuff to go over, that's for sure. And a quick video, but the stuff that I do have for sale, I wanted to show real quick. And, uh, mostly it's the stuff up here up front. Then I got some collecting type stuff that I'm bringing out little by little. The 70 GMC is a really cool truck. It's got a 396 uh, 402, that oddball type year thing. Essentially, you got a 396, it's a little bigger, but it's the same dang motor. Clean truck. It's a really clean truck. It is. As you can tell, the bed ain't from the right here. Nice and tight. You should hear the doors on that Dodge. I did them in the walk around video. The 442 I'll get out here at some point. I got stuff sitting in piles everywhere. I do. I really do. This van. I've shown it, but I haven't really went around it. I'll go around it a little bit more. There's only a couple areas like that. Overall, it's super clean. The step comes out with the... Whoa! <laughs> I don't know if the gas pose right. Where's the middle part? It's gone. Really? I'm gonna have to find a cover for that? That might not be easy. Wow. I don't know what exactly the springs are for. Maybe they had blinds in it or something. It's a clean truck. All the strippings here. Of course, the factory stuff's falling down. Um, got the original head and motor and stuff. But it's a clean little rig. See that hooks up right to there. And it pulls that step out. That ain't right, but whatever. How many windows does she have? I guess we count these, right? They have a divider. One, would be four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen window van. Got lots of these Trans Ams. In fact, the only thing I won't sell is the one up there in that 442. 
but some special edition ones, some regular ones, some of this, a little bit of this and a little bit of that. Um, it's a relatively clean Centurion. Um, there's a vinyl top, of course it's gone. Looks like he had a blowout. And just kind of <coughs> whip that up. Yeah, it looks like he kind of smacks the door into something, don't it? Um, and that's your major rod. Other than that, what am I to talk about? He dinged it up here. Just must have ran it down something. Um, I'm probably just gonna polish this thing up and sell it as is. This site's really clean. That part's not. Need a little bit of work, huh? It's a little bit of hot rust starting down there. Well, no, it's definitely started. But it's a nice little car. It really is. It's all here. Love the logo. Jeez. And everything I got here in this little last thing, the door's closed like new. It's amazing. So that's all that. I got a little 63 Tempest of Mons V8 326 five lug. A lot of these were four lug. Got the Jimmy. And this thing is clean. It runs good. Um, it needs some working. But it's clean. It's all here. I'll be putting a video of this up, of this up soon. I'll walk around this stuff over here. I'm going to walk down the Trans Am line, so I don't think I did. Well, I know I walked past it, but basically the bulk of my stuff right now is between 76 and 79. Um, so, yeah, that's what it is. The rarest one I have is that. It's 50th anniversary, 455 four speed. First year of all the cool flashy birds. Last year of the 455. This one ain't really... That's cool, but it's super cool. It's a four-speed 400. Um, what does it say? Formula 400. There you go. So, just to show a couple more, and show the, this thing in full. It's pretty clean, man. And like I showed this in one of the other videos. Look at these, they're there. It's amazing. Amazing, look at this. It's a 400. A nice rig. Somebody's gonna really enjoy this. Make a good project for somebody. I picked this up at a local auction. It's got really low miles. Um, and it's a generally clean little car. 89 thou on it. Uh, this thing, same guy that did the paint on the uh, big limo. So it's kind of... But it's a nice car, low miles. In fact, the beauty of this one is the miles. It'll polish out and still look good. It's just set out here got dust on it. Look at this. Just beautiful. That's what happens when you get them weeds and you crush them in the doors and next thing you know it's on the side. Brooklyn, I got two of these and this Eldo. There's a full video of this on my channel. There's a full video of that. There's videos of us tinkering with that. Um, and there's not much more videos except for the stuff out front. So basically, other than that, I got the Lexus here and I got this here Monte Carlo. I'm going to do a video on that right now to get some community help on what y'all think I should do to it. This has a new head gasket. It's all ready to go. And this here, it's ready to go. But <laughs> it ain't got what we were going to do to it. I'm going to go ahead and say goodbye and hang up the old camera. Like, subscribe, comment, all that stuff. I will do a more thorough walk around and stuff when it's a different time. It's just right now, there's no way to do this. It's just, it's hectic. I'll tell you. In fact... I didn't show the sob, and again, Paul Phil, thank you for sending me this piece of trim. That was awesome. He sent me the trim. There's nothing on the back of the trim to hold it on, and the one that came had tape. See, this does not have tape. It has some stuff at the top. Oh well, that's for a different video. Play a little manual car, 116 on it. I dig them. Okay, that's that. Oh no, the chickens are coming to get me. It's like the birds, but it's the chickens. Okay, thanks for watching. Have a great day and night. Whatever it is, wherever you are, subscribe, like, comment. Talk to you tomorrow.